Joe Burrow's out for the season with uh, something going on with his wrist. Um, after a controversial video that, you know, was around Twitter and the X universe of Joe Burrow getting off the plane going to Baltimore, it looked like I th- we all thought he was going bowling. You know what mm, I mean? He had that wrist mm, thing on. Yes, Turned sir. out he was not going bowling. His uh, wrist was hurt. Cincinnati Bengals Twitter, or X, I'm sorry, removed it. Never seen again. It was erased from history. Never happened. Nobody sees, nobody knows. But, Everybody uh, seen. He was not on the injury report. It was a little sketchy. Then he goes out there, gets tackled, and... There goes his wrist. Goodbye wrist. He was on the sideline, he said. Yeah, he couldn't even hold the ball. Instantly. So, just, is there anybody they can go pick up? Yeah. Tank's guy. Tour Ooh. guy. Phil Carson Brown. Wentz. He's on the He's Rams, on the Rams dude. dog. I don't know. You don't know. Yeah, I can tell I you for know. sure. He's de- he definitely on the Rams. Bro. I don't know. <laughs> no practice squad or none. He's he's with them for real. Until Ross, he gets cut. <laughs> Jeez, why they, if sign him to cut him. Ah, oh, well, maybe he's like, hey, coach, pretty please, let me leave. I want to go right. to the Bengals. <laughs> I'll tell you what, Los Angeles. I don't think they're known for their hunting scene. So Cincinnati, he could be he could go out in the woods over there. Yeah, he could probably go get some. Who else? Anybody else? All right, yeah, I was about you to say, but for, for real. Dobbs? <laughs> One at a time, please. <laughs> well, they can't trade now. They definitely can't do that. But uh, who else is left? Josh Dobbs can play for both teams. I looked it up the other day. Cause because I think that, that's that's what came to my mind as soon as he went down. Matt Ryan. Cause did Matt Joe... Ryan was on the list. That's, I'll, that's, I'll pull it back up. That's I'll terrible. See if I have it. Joe Flacco got signed, I'm pretty sure. Head of the Browns yeah. practice squad, which... um. But... Kind of, it's a little confusing to me. I mean, DTR didn't look too bad. I mean, if you look just at his, in case, if you look at his stat line, you would assume the game he had a terrible game. But if you were watching that game, which I definitely fell asleep at some point, yeah, I don't know who um, would watch that. DTR looked poised and looked like he grew up from his last uh, start against the Ravens earlier this season, which is all you want, just improvement. Feel me? Slowly but surely. There's nobody else. Yeah, I'm trying to. Get I don't this, know. I'm trying to get this list back up. Johnny Manziel. No. He's out there. <laughs> I don't think there's no more guys. Yeah. yeah so that list number one was Carson. He's on the Rams. See you later. Number two was Matt Ryan. Oh my gosh. Currently calling games with CBS, so I don't know the. Um, oh. I how, know. Re- how realistic that may be. I know, garbage. I know a guy. Colt McCoy is on this list. Forgot about him. Joe Flacco. Terrible, there. terrible. And Donnie was calling. I forgot what team you're calling to sign him earlier this season. Cole McCoy? Nah, Nick Foles. Yes. <laughs> Nick Foles is the one. He's still out there. I don't think so. He's the one, bro. Do he, it. You, sh- you do it. Pick him up. The Jets should get him. That's who I was saying. The Jets Boom. should get him. Jets would have a better record right now with Nick Foles than they do with Zach Wilson. You sure? And Bob Boyle. Tim? I'm just making up names. I don't know who that guy is. Call up Mike White. Where is he? He signed with Miami. They let him go. What about the long neck guy? He, the guy from North Tonawanda? No, no, no. The uh, you're not talking about I Mike mean, Lennon. No, the guy that played for the Texans last year. You're talking about Mike the Lennon? dude that? Oh, Davis Mills. Yeah, oh, where's Dougie he at? Mills. Where's he at? Oh, he's still in Houston. Well, let him go. Ah, <laughs> <laughs> oh, you don't need him. Hey, you don't need him. You got a different guy that could throw p- three picks. Oh, here's Come a guy. On. Um. He started for the Rams at the end of last year. Bryce Perkins, I don't know. Do you guys remember him? I don't even remember him. Oh, he wasn't good. He it's probably throw. for the best, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> he was all right. No, he wasn't good. And I wanted him to be good. He wasn't. Didn't, he played in XFL, too, didn't he? I don't have my uh, Bryce Perkins uh, Couldn't tell. biopic. <laughs> hey, I'm going to be honest with you. Going into this episode today, I did not expect to bring up Bryce Perkins' name. But no. Bryce Perkins, Here we are. If you're out there, shout out you, man. We hope Yo, you shout out Bryce Perkins. All right. Honestly, I hope they pick him up just for the vibes. I got a name now. He was just on TV. RG3. I mean, Yo, probably he he's better than everyone else on that list. RG3 did make a, uh, a case for him this yeah. past week. Who, who did you guys see the video? He did this like four weeks ago, too. He yeah. He keeps doing this. Really? Well, for the, our listeners out there that may not know what we're talking about, uh, yeah, we RG3. Talk about- he put out a video of him, like, explaining why Cleveland Browns should sign him, why he's a good fit. Um, 
And he said, hey, listen, I don't got to start. He said, even though I can still run a four or something. Um, he can still run a four or something? That's yeah. A four what? A I, four I don't want to misquote the guy. So I don't know. If he's running a four or nine, I don't want him. No, it wasn't four or nine. Four or four? I think around there. That's crazy. Yeah, I think he did say that. But he, was, but he did say, he goes, I know all these different offenses at this point in my career, this and that. Um, I was already there. Which what? I don't, did he play under Kevin Stefanski when he was with the Browns? I don't, I don't think even so. remember. Anywho. I think it was before him. Anywho. Uh, yeah, he was just like, I could back up DTR. I could give him all the experience he needs, let him know what's up. He's not getting paid enough on TV or what? I don't know because I thought he was starting to make a presence in the media game. Yeah, I thought he'd be making some money over there. I don't think. Uh, I think he'd rather play football as a backup for the Browns. I think he'd Yo, rather play too, football. That'd <laughs> right, be cool. Hey, if the Browns call me right now. Shit. But if, yeah, ES- if the Browns called you, said you want to come be backup quarterback, or ESPN called you and said you want to be an analyst, well, who's paying most? I'll take a shot at a Super Bowl. I don't think the Browns are paying that much to a backup quarterback. I don't know. So they're paying a lot to their starters, so you might be right. Oh, another quick thing about the quarterback injuries this year. Yeah, what about it? Very similar to 2017. Um, oh, yeah. Rodgers was out for the season. Yep. He's out this season. He's not out for the season, though. He's coming. I hope. I hope not. Okay. Watson <laughs> was out for the season. He's out again. It's a bum. Terrible. The Bengals, number one overall pick, not that year, but in general. Um, Carson Palmer. He still played for the Bengals that year? No, he's with the uh, Cardinals. Yeah, he's with the Cardinals, I think. He's yeah. good on the Cardinals. But in general, number one overall pick for the Bengals went down. Happens again. Colts, QB1 went down for the season. Happens again. And then next season after that. Comeback player of the year was Colts quarterback one. Could it be Colts QB one again? I don't know. It's going to be Joey B, dog. No, it's going to be Aaron Rodgers if he doesn't come back this year. I guess the point I was making was that it's kind of crazy how similar to what was the 27. That is crazy. And was that the year when um, Case Keenum, Nick Foles was in the yep. NFC Championship, then it was Tom Brady and fucking Blake Bortles? <laughs> I think you might see that again this year. Blake Bortles deserved to win that game.